The largest loggerhead turtle ever rehabilitated by Moat Marine Laboratory is back in the Gulf tonight. Moat scientists released a 300-pound turtle named Murph this morning at Lido Beach. It's a male tag with a transmitter that sends data back about temperature, location, and depth. Male sea turtles rarely come back to the beach unless they're injured. A few studies have been conducted on their behavior. Any data that we can collect, um, this one has dive temperature, it has um, location as well as a dive profile, so depth. And um, we sh we're hoping that it stays on at least a year, uh, but it really depends on the battery and how fast it gets up by, um, made up by this turtle. The sheer size of this animal, lifting, weighing, moving him, um, and frankly just getting him to eat um, in captivity was an issue for us and we needed him to eat so he could heal and get him out and it took about three months to get that whole process pulled together. Moat crews and state wildlife officials rescued Murph on Memorial Day in South Sarasota County. The turtle's neck and flippers were entangled in crab traps and fishing line. There were also a pair of shark hooks in its shell.